Hello everyone. Um, today I wanted to talk about ESTJs. Um, a very interesting group. Um, I've seen things about you know um, I guess the NFs and I guess the INFJs and other people I guess talking shit about ESTJs and <clears throat> kind of dealing with them um, and having trouble with uh, ESTJs. But you know here's the thing I really really like ESTJs and here's why. They don't do what I do, which is let everyone just walk all over you. Like I just let everyone walk all over me all the time, and just let and just like like keep everything open and keep everything um, kind of just like um, um, where I just want to expect to do everything for everyone. And, and, and they set boundaries. Like they just like here's the boundary. Like they immediately set boundaries right away. I feel like um, I, I definitely know a few ESTJs, and I think I actually I think the people I'm closest to. It's really weird, um, considering that that like I typically just like that, like, very rule-abiding, very normal, very regular person, very, um, <clears throat> you know, just being an SJ as far as, but being, um, but, you know, they're also very good leaders, I think. I think that they're very good leaders. Um, and, you know, they kind of, sim like, like, to me, they symbolize the establishment. They symbolize the regular person. They, they, they symbolize, um, um, well, all, the, all the SJs, to me, at least, do. But they symbolize the, uh, you know, just a regular person. So um, I think that they, they that that's fine because I think that they do defend the regular values of society. And I think because I this, go through this myself, and I think that the regular values of society are good. Um, I think that they are for the most part. I think that they, you know, can be great people. I mean, I just see I see different temperaments. Like there can be evil uh, ESCJs. I'm evil. Yes, ESTJs and good ESTJs. So, um, there's good and bad personality types. No matter where you go, um, you know, I just really think that they, um, you know, they can be very good leaders, and they just—it's just the extroverted thinking comes out. Um, they're just going to speak their mind. They're definitely going to speak their mind, um, influence people, um, kind of go with that. Um, I did have some struggle with a. Yeah, I initially do have a lot of struggle with some ESTJs. I I think that they are so strict and rule abiding and, and very difficult to deal with. But once I notice that, once I get to know them, and I'm like, okay, that person's an ESTJ. I think, wow, that's just that's great. I think that that's great because they they set boundaries very easily and they're like very just um they do the opposite of what I do is that they they don't overextend themselves and it's just like like so they're gonna excel well in the administrative fields are going to sell well and just I guess the kind of um, normal kind of positions where where they can be administrative more administrators and just and just in dealing with the concrete real world of things they're going to be able to, to, to do well in that scenario and I find that fascinating because I can't do well in that scenario so I learn from them I definitely learn from them because I hate the real world scenario and they're just living in that real world all the time and they, they you know they kind of are that and they do make a big bulk of the population and all that but ESHJs can also feel isolated from other like probably SJs and shit like like they feel um they feel they you know they they feel like they should be the leaders and they speak their mind a lot, and they, but the, the big, their problem is that they ignore other people's, like, his opinions or feelings or thoughts or, um, sometimes. So, I mean, that, that could be a bad thing if you're an ESTJ. So, um, but the people who I have, you know, kind of interacted with, right, who have, I'm like, oh, like, you're an ESTJ, I think that they've been good people for the most part. So, um, I kind of really like them that they, they, they do set boundaries and they just, they don't let people, um, um, you know, they do, they do have some structure to their lives, and they do try to accomplish things, and they and they do are just living a normal life, and I think living a normal life is good, um, for the most part. I don't think that they um, try to do any too many crazy things. I mean, I can't imagine, I can't really imagine that me a CJ artist, or, um, <coughs> um, or like a really deep philosopher. There, there are out there, I'm not saying that, but it's, it's, it's more rare. There's more rare occasions for these things. Um, um. And, you know, and they're just very much of the bulk of the society. They are, and um, and for the most part, I think society is not bad. <laughs> so, um, hold on one minute. I gotta drink a little bit. So, I mean, like, but, but like the one problem I've always had, 
um, with, I guess, ESTJ is that they are very, very, like, stubborn, um, very strict, very, uh, you know, don't, don't mess with me, and, like, so they will, they will, as far as the sensing type, just really just cling to the past, and, you know, just want everything to be the same all the time, but you have to know that everything can't be the same all the time, because there's this universal thing called change, and... They try to hold on to that. So when I try to change something for the, like for what I see is the better, see the future kind of a little bit, they hesitate a lot. But that's fine because it's a balance. They want it to be balanced. I can't. If everything was the future, it'd be willy nilly. There'd be no practical applications for it. They are the practical application people, and that's important. Very important. So um, I've taken a very good understanding of what ESGJs are like, and I think that they're good people. For the most part, there can be bad ones. The bad one I've seen is Stalin, <laughs> like someone who just exerts her authority over everyone. Like that's a bad ESTJ. Um, but most of them are just good, hardworking, regular people, um, and can be very, um, you know, help, can can also contribute. And, and, and anyone, and I've seen a lot of videos that any personality type can become famous. So and and and, and help the world. So they definitely can help the world too. So anyone can help the world. Um, and I do, I just do like, I like their directness. I like their, um, uh, you know, they won't, they won't overextend themselves. They will set boundaries and limits. And that is a different, that's different than, way different than me. And I can, I just think it's a talent in some ways. Like, it's just, it, it's an, if intriguing to me and fascinating. So, um, let me know what you guys think. I, I like ESTJs. I like, I like thinkers a lot because I think that they can, they can, they can kind of, distinguish between like like just like always trying to please other people and to me that is so refreshing at least in this period of time for me so um okay guys i um, just want to make that quick video so thanks guys later